Hey guys, Dr. Colin Miller here, physical therapist with ProKinetics at the True location. Today we're going to talk about rehabbing an ankle sprain. I know a lot of us have to get creative, get outside for our exercise, and sometimes that leads to injury, especially ankle sprains. So we're going to talk about four um, types of rehabs that we can do for our ankle to uh, get us back out there and running. So, the first one is for mobility, and this one's quite simple. We need no equipment. We're going to do that ankle alphabet. So, what we start with is our capital letters. We can do one ankle or both ankles, does not matter. So we want big strokes, as big as we can go. We're going to start with our A, go from B all the way to Z, okay? We want to do this at least three sets twice a day. Um, you can do this in seated, you can do this in standing while you're waiting in line somewhere, you can do this lying down. It's a really good exercise to get that mobility going to get some blood flow to those, to those joints there. Our next exercise is going to start to strengthen our base of our foot, our plantar fascia, or what we call our foot intrinsics. These are the um, foundations for our feet. And this is going to help us strengthen the, the total chain. So what we're going to do is we're going to use a towel. We're going to set it down. And we're going to do what are called toe curls. So when I'm focusing on this, I'm trying to pull my big toe towards my heel. I don't want to see the ankle rolling either direction, OK? So we're going to pull that big toe towards the heel. We're trying to curl that towel. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a side view for you. So, as you can see, I have a little bit of an arch, and as I curl, I create that bigger arch, and that's going to start to work those foot intrinsics. We want to do about 20 reps of those, because our plantar fascia is what we call an endurance muscle. It's working all day, every day, so we need a lot of repetitions to start to work those muscles. As that gets easy, we can do movement with our towel curls. So I can curl, I can sweep in, we, we can do 10 reps sweeping in, and then we can do curl and then sweeping out. This will start to work the plantar fascia in different directions, getting a little more dynamic. All right, so we've worked on mobility. We started working our plantar fascia. Next, we need to work the ankle and the stability muscles around there. So what you'll need is a band. And what we're going to do is we're working all four directions the ankle moves. The first one is going to be pushing down. So we're going to drive our foot down towards the floor. This is working our, our calf, which are, we have a few muscles back there. Our gastroc, our gastrocnemius, and our soleus. So those are the two big muscles back there that we like to use. Again, these are endurance muscles, so we need to do high repetitions. So 15 to 20 reps for the down. Next, we want to work the outside of our ankle, which are called our peroneals. These help with stability, so our ankle does not um, roll again. So, what we're going to do is we're going to bring our foot out and kind of make that outside of the foot turn up towards the ceiling, just like so, okay? Kind of a windshield wiper with a little bit of a rotation, all right? So again, 20 reps. Now that we've worked the outside, we need to work the inside. So what we're going to do, keeping that band on both feet, we're going to bring our ankle onto our knee, and now we're trying to bring our foot up towards the ceiling. Now this is working the inside. Again, those 20 reps. Last but not least, we want to bring our foot up towards our knee to work the front of our calf. And so what we're going to do is, is we're going to get our ankle onto our knee. Go ahead and throw that band over the top of your foot here. We're going to pull away, and we're going to pull our foot towards our knee, just like so. This is going to start to work that anterior part of the leg. Again, 20 reps. All right, so we've worked the ankle, we've worked the bottom foot, we've worked mobility. The last but not least is we need to work those calves that drive that force. So if you're having significant pain, but we still want to work these muscles, we're going to start in a seated position. And what we'll do is we're going to come up on the toes, slowly come back down, back up onto the toes. You guessed it, 15 to 20 reps for these. If, if this is too easy and you're not in much pain, what we're going to do is go to standing. So what we can do is use something to balance, either a counter or a wall per se. And what we're going to do is we're going to use that to balance. We're going to come up on the toes, slowly back down. We'll do 15 to 20 reps in the straight and 
and then we want to go heels together to start working the inside of our calf. So again, coming up on the toes, not allowing the ankles to roll out. We're going to do 20 reps. And last but not least, bringing the toes together. Now this one's a little difficult, so we don't roll our ankles out, okay? So we really need to push through the, the, the toes and come up as high as we can. And that's going to work more of the outside of the calf. Go through this once or twice a day, and you should be back out on the road in no time.